Welcome back to Channel One. As promised, I told you in one of my other videos, I talked a little bit about this trailer light uh, testing box that I had built. Basically, uh, what it is is so I can uh, take the vehicle out of the equation and just plug this directly into the trailer lights on the trailer and test them while I'm working on it. Uh, it makes things go a lot quicker without having to worry about hooking up a vehicle. Uh, it basically is just an ammo box that I had picked up, I think, at Harbor Freight years ago. And I've built several of these. This is probably my favorite one so far because it's so compact and it's got the nice handle. Um, so once you take the power supply out of an old computer, that's what worked good for me. I kind of cut the hole, stuck it in there, screwed it in there. And then I went ahead and I tricked the power supply on a computer to turn it on. And uh, I've got a video on how to do that. And then on the end here, I've got the seven-way uh, plug adapter for plugging into various trailers. I like this one here because it gives me a lot of versatile, versatility. And then I can use the four-prong if I need to. I can plug this in here, and that gives me the four-prong for some of the smaller trailers. Got the on and on switch here that we have. And then we got the uh, right blinker, the left blinker, the marker lights, and I also have brakes as well. So if this has electric brakes, I can go ahead and test the brakes as well. Uh, so not a whole lot to this, uh, obviously the Chateron uh, stencil that I make, and the CR basically just stands for uh, Chateron-14 uh, is when my channel was created, so that's kind of why I wanted to put it on there, uh, to uh, just kind of jazz it up a little bit. Uh, so again, if this is something that you're interested in and knowing a little bit more about, maybe I can do a breakdown of the schematic, so uh, that's basically all there is to it. Well, I hope this helps and I hope this answers some of the questions. I know people have seen this in my, um, some of my other videos and I love this. This works really well and again, it takes the vehicle out of the equation. Thanks an awful lot for watching and we'll see you on the next one.